This is not a political rally or a political gathering. It is the frontage of the Christ Church Cathedral, Marina, Lagos. The course of the fight is reportedly linked to an attempt to prevent Archbishop Adibola Adimowo from gaining entrance to conduct service. Before now, the church had denied any existence of crisis in the diocese. STV gathered that the remote cause was the fallout of the Episcopal Synod in Iloran Choir State Capital, where Bishop Humphrey Olumakai emerged as the incoming Archbishop of the Lagos Diocese. He is from Oshun North East Diocese. Some aggrieved members allege that his emergence was as a result of financial inducement by the outgoing Archbishop Adibola Adimowo. All the allegations against the Archbishop include sought to tenure elongation for Archbishop Adimowo, facilitation of a multi millionaire house for Primate Nicholas Oko in the Lekki area of Lagos, outrageous retirement package of about 250 million naira. Collection of 200 million naira to build retirement house for himself. In a response to the petition and allegation, the clergyman explained that, quote, It is an established fact that houses are built for retiring bishops as well as vehicles purchased for them by their diocese. End of quote. He also argued that, quote, Diocese of Lagos West built a house in Lagos for the Right Reverend Peter Adebi at a cost of over 200 million naira in 2013, end of quote. Not convinced by this response, the disaffection between these members and their spiritual leader snowballed into this heavy security presence in and around the church. The man at the eye of the storm insisted that there is no cause for alarm despite this drama. Okay, so can you tell us, uh, do you have you privy to some of the drama happening outside the church? No, there was no drama. There was no drama. There, you know, area boys, they normally make noise. So they were babblers. They were just making noise. It's usual for people to make noise. I think they were excited. They were excited to see us. Okay, sir. Thank so you. there was no noise at all. According to one of the petitioners, Yomi Fini, he is not satisfied with the Archbishop's response. Uh, we've been having quite some problem with the Bishop of our diocese and uh, we have not been able to resolve it completely. Is, uh, there is a lot of uh, evidence against him as regards what he has done, particularly with the resources of the church. And I believe this is being investigated. Uh, but there is a problem with, with him. He still doesn't want to cooperate with uh, the uh, congregation in the sense that uh, a lot of questions are being asked and he's refusing to answer him. And uh, the message, of course, has been sent uh, to the Church of Nigeria Anglican Communion in Abuja. And I hope that uh, the primate will do something about him very soon. How this issue will be resolved by the leadership of the Anglican Communion is of keen interest to many. STV will bring you updates as events unfold. Kaya Deladeinde, STV News.